you got to understand this. I was in a production deal. So I was signed to Patchworks to Priority. Mm. Um, Rockefeller would never have escaped from Priority Records if it wasn't for, for Todd Terry. For real? Wow. He He's the one that dropped them. They wanted out. You got to remember, Reasonable Doubt came out and didn't do well. Mm. Because, yeah. because because uh, their presidents was the single. So I remember the B-side was Ain't No Nigga. And I remember when they were trying which, to which get blew a up. Vi- that did blow up. It didn't blow up. No, so let, let me explain to you. Go on, I'm, I'm, I'm trying go to put it in time context. Go on, go on, go on. So that record is doing well in New York. And so Rockefeller goes back to Priority and says, yo, I think we need to shoot, we need to shoot a video for the B-side. And Capitol Records says immediately, never in life. Your A side didn't win. We're never going to shoot a video for this. Uh, Fuck you. Uh. And so no video was shot. Now, fast forward maybe a month or so, uh, Russell Simmons has si- signed Foxy already. Jay Z's writing for Foxy and says, I need to blow up Foxy. This record is bubbling in New York. Hmm. Puts it on the Who's the Band soundtrack and ah, shoots a video. Okay. Then the single goes gold and drives the album gold, and Jay Z and them immediately leave party. Now, if if Woo. just think about this, if if but they can't leave party. They're in a contract. Mm-hmm. They want to go to they want to go to Def Jam because that opportunity's there now. But party, they just went gold. On a record that they thought yeah, yeah, was yeah, dead yeah. Exactly. five months ago, mm. they just went gold on a single and gold on an album. They're not letting them go. So yeah. guess who let them go? Todd. Todd Terry. He's the middleman. <clears throat> wow. So they didn't have to ask Party. Todd was just like, oh, I dropped them. Because they went and hit Todd like, yo, man, we so, want like this shit. Fuck this shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We want to go to Def Jam. They failed us. Priority failed us. We want to go, and that was a whole thing. They used to talk shit at Priority, but that's the real story. You can look at the numbers, look at the time, look at the date. Reasonable Doubt was out for three months before Ain't No Nigga video got shot, and Priority Records never shot that video. Whoa. That was Def Jam for Who's the Man soundtrack. And then Jay-Z, yeah. after that record with Certified Gold, they skipped out, left Priority, and the next album came out on Def, Def Jam. Jam. Yeah. But that's only because Todd Terry. Yeah. Signed him out. Yeah, yeah, signed him out, which under normal stance is not going to happen. Yeah, yeah.